Welcome back. In this video, I'm going to teach you more Chekhov exercises. The first exercise I want to focus on is warming up your ideal center. This exercise is designed to help you center yourself before you begin creating art. In order to perform this warm up, begin by standing in a state of readiness. Then take a step back and take note of everything in your life that is affecting you at the moment. After several moments have passed, in your own time, make the decision to let go of everything that is affecting you. Then rub the palms of your hands together quickly to create friction. Then lift them above you to the sun and bring them to your center, your heart. You can even jump up if you want to when you reach for the sun. Then place your hands onto the center of your chest and feel the warmth from them. In your own time, take a step forward. You are now ready to work as an artist as your ideal center, as Chekhov calls it, is warmed up. Ideally this center, your feeling center, is where you want to work from as an actor. The next exercise I want to show you is staccato legato. This exercise is designed to help you focus, give you a feeling of energy and ease, and provide you with a feeling of the whole. To perform staccato legato, begin by standing in a state of readiness with your feet shoulder width apart. In this exercise, you are going to move in all six directions, right, left, up, down, forward, and backward, and in that order. As you move in each direction, make sure that you inhale as you execute each form and exhale as you radiate. To help with radiating, imagine that your hands are holding tennis balls and that you are slowly releasing them with your fingertips. Begin with moving your right foot to your right. Let your elbows, forearms, and fingertips come up. Make sure you radiate all of that energy through your fingertips and the rest of your body. Then return to a state of readiness. Then perform the same movement to your left. Make sure that your gaze follows your fingertips. To go up, begin by bending your knees slightly and then come up with your arms and fingertips extending to the sky. You bend your knees first to get a sense of the polarity. To go down, plant one of your legs in front of you. Then move your hands in front of you with your fingertips pointing downward. To go forward, Take a step in front of you and ensure that your torso is both open and heading forward. Reach with your fingertips. To go backward, place one of your legs behind you. Then open your hands behind you and really feel that backspace. As far as the pattern for staccato legato goes, you are going to move in all six directions for a total of six times. To begin with, you are going to do staccato twice moving in all six directions. When I say staccato, I mean quick, choppy movements. Then you are going to do legato twice, moving in all six directions. When I say legato, I mean smooth, flowing movements. Then you will do one round of staccato and one round of legato. You can use this warm-up to create a feeling of ease, to center yourself, and to raise your awareness of how to move in the space. Staccato legato can also be performed with a group.